is Jonathan Adler, U.S. Nationalist Report. I'm checking on these private security companies. Hold on, guys. Uh, I had one of these uh, Allied Universal guys try to force me off the sidewalk uh, when I was doing a story. And um, he didn't know what the First Amendment was. And I told him that includes freedom of the press. How you doing, sir? How are you? Good, good. How are you? Buenos noches. What country are you from? I'm a reporter. What country are you from uh, originally? Where you I'm a reporter. I'm doing a story. <laughs> well, it's okay, man. I don't, I'm okay. You're not going to answer me? Uh, no. Are you from the United States? I'm done, man. You're done? Why don't you just say yes or no? Uh, yeah, I am. You were born in the United States? Yes, sir. Okay. okay. You know our First Amendment? Can you tell me? Uh, look, man, I'm working right now. Okay. Yeah, well, I had an issue with one of your guys. He uh, told me to get off the sidewalk when I was trying to do a story. I, I have work, too. I have a job, too. And I don't appreciate your company forcing reporters off the sidewalk. Okay. So I'm going to check to see if your people know our laws. Because okay. if you're going to give people orders, you guys got to know what the laws are. Okay. So can you tell me the First Amendment, please? Uh, d d look, man, I don't have to. Um... If you, have have any, to. if you have any concerns, or uh -huh. if you have any... What's your name, sir? Like um, your full name. I'm giving you my name, so I don't have to, but I'm completely okay with it. Okay, that, what's right? your full name, sir? It's Ruben. Ruben what? That's all I'm giving you, man. Okay. Why don't you want to give me your full name? Because uh, I don't feel comfortable with it, okay? All right. Are you respecting civil rights, sir? All right, I'm done, man. Okay. And who's paying your salary? Because if you're getting tax money, uh, you will have to be held accountable, sir. So far, you're not viola violating any laws, but one of your other uh, people in your company did violate my rights, sir. Okay? If you make a false complaint, I'll have to sue you, sir. Have a nice evening. Remember, a false complaint is one year in prison. Have a nice evening, sir. And I don't know why you're ashamed to tell me your name. Just don't break any more laws, buddy. You're subject to the laws here just like everybody else. So, hey, guys. Um trying to interview this private security, Allied Universal, uh, all these guys that I meet are Latino, they're usually foreign Latino, speaking Spanish. And so I was asking them what country he's from, because they do heavily discriminate against uh, white people. Never seen a white employee for Allied Universal here or in Los Angeles. And that's one issue. Secondly, I did a report on one of their employees uh, forcing a homeless lady off a sidewalk because she was asking people for money. Now, I realize it's kind of a nuisance that uh, homeless people ask for money, but it is protected under our First Amendment panhandling, begging, as long as you're not threatening violence or harassing is protected under the First Amendment. So it is um, violating that person's civil rights, especially if a private security guard tells them they can't do that and to move off of a public sidewalk. And then 
had a third incident with the same company, Allied Universal, where I was doing a news story. Uh, it was actually a fundraiser for the IDF. And um, uh, a guy at the bar that worked at the bar, smoking gun, in San Diego, he made a false complaint on me to Allied Universal. He basically told him he, he didn't want me on the sidewalk, which um, he has no authority to tell me to leave the sidewalk just because he didn't like the way I answered him. And then their Allied Universal uh, employee showed up and he told me to relo relocate. I didn't follow his uh, unlawful order. And then I told him I am a professional reporter. I was doing a story. And um, I told him the First Amendment includes freedom of the press. And then he falsely claimed the First Amendment does not include freedom of the press. So these are serious uh, civil rights violations by this private company, Allied Universal, against US citizens. And also, after seeing hundreds of their employees, I do know they discriminate in particular against white US citizens. And they are hiring foreign nationals, possibly also illegal aliens that are hostile to the United States and our citizens. Thanks for watching. So I'd like everybody to call Allied Universal legally and lawfully and tell them this type of behavior and unlawful actions are not acceptable. Thanks for watching.